Hi YouTube, how are you doing? This is Silent Hill, a short message, and I'm so excited for it. I've just been telling my chat that I'm a lifelong Silent Hill fan. I've played lots and lots of games in the series. Not so much maybe the later ones, and there's a couple of missing rare ones that I haven't played, but I'm going to get around to those eventually. But you can definitely tell because of the Silent Hill 2 Halo of the Sun hoodie that's on my chair. I've got a wooden cutout of the same. I've got the mirror plushie. I've got the Room 312 keyring because... Some, some super fans will know what that means. I've even got the Silent Hill 1 map that's hung up on the wall next to me. But I digress. This is Silent Hill The Short Message, and I am dead excited. It was uh, announced and released less than 24 hours ago. So, super duper excited to dive in. So let's just dive straight in, shall we? Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. I want to be strong on my own without a group. If there were only someone who would understand that to adult me. I don't know I don't know if that's how that was supposed to sound. To adult me. I think that was a letter to their adult self. We've lost counts of how many there are now. I know that there's three and four in a room, and then homecoming, shattered memories, origins, downpour, and god knows how many more. Yeah, there's lots. There's lots. There's only a couple that actually sync up together. Um, Maya. Who's oh hello? Oh. What? I have a phone. I don't, I don't know. What's the circle on the, what's the circle on there? <gasps> we get to see the actual phone. Wow, Maya, I want to show you something. Can you come to the villa? Oh, yeah. Maya told me to come here. Oh, man, this looks good. This looks real good. Just see if I can... Controls. Yeah, no, that's fine. Options. Volume. There we go. There we go. Do we have subtitles? The subtitles are on, weren't they? Yeah. Good. Resume. <laughs> Villa Inn. Oh, this looks good. I like that we're using a phone as a flashlight. What is this? What is this? Show me. I want to zoom in. Surely I can zoom in. It's a it's a horror game. I can definitely. Oh, I can't. <laughs> okay. Open. Oh, this is a good looking game. I mean, I'd expect it to be a good looking game. Welcome to the city of hope. City of something hope. City of no hope. But city of something hope. Was there not a city near Silent Hill that was like New Hope or something like that? I can't remember. Villa. Example. This model. Is it this building? How do you not know how you got here? Well, I guess you don't know how you got here, but like, do you? Do we not know where we are? Is that the thing? Fuck! <laughs> God, that was someone stood there then. What's this? Some cool art right here. Teddy, hello, Teddy. It's concerning how many people have a light on their phones and still half panic due to no flashlight. Like, you're holding one already. Use that oddly shaped flashlight. Yeah. <laughs> I had a phone that just generally was just an oddly shaped flashlight. Uh, plans to rebuild Kettenstart. Kettenstart? An overview. Kettenstart, the town with a long history as a thriving border stronghold. In recent years, those in their 20s have become leaving en masse, causing concern. 
The aim of the wide scale project is to rebuild Kettenstart and restore it to its former glory with the help of Chinese investment firms. Oh, that'll go well. The theme is revitalization. The abandoned properties developed by Japanese corporations in 2008 have long been a problem. But by repurposing them, we can cut costs substantially and better realize our vision for a new Kettenstart. Hail Kettenstart. Wow. So this place didn't always suck. Well, Our parents dreamed of this? I mean, it might have always sucked. Who knows? And the plans to rebuild Kettenstart have suffered yet another major setback as instability caused by the COVID-19 pandemic has reduced interest from foreign investors. Previous plans to jumpstart the town have failed to materialize only owing to the monetary instability caused by the 2008 global financial crisis, which forced the plan to involve Japanese corporations and financial institutions to be reconsidered. Whew. This is a little on the nose, isn't it? Uh, two attempts to rebuild two failures due to unfortunate external circumstances. Kettenstart has struggled to bounce back with increased unemployment. The city council is considering ways to revitalize the economy by drawing skilled experts to the area, but as of yet, no effective measures have been implemented. I know, let's Everyone's open a portal to hell. Futures. It's all adults are. Uh, what? To the system. You're not going to mention that? We're not going to talk about that? <laughs> We're not... We're not going to talk about the fact the door just opened on its own. Police tape there. Well, it's not police tape. It's just keep out tape. Uh, Where are you, Maya? A very good question. Room 201. Note that down. Note that down. I'm not going into this expecting, like, oh, there's this Easter egg for Silent Hill 2 and this Easter egg for this Silent Hill game. I think this is going to be more like... I feel like this is going to be what... There's going to be PT DNA in this. So that's what I think. I think this is going to be like the idea or like the rough outline of what they had for PT. Oh, great. Maybe with different it's characters, locked. maybe a different setting, but I think that's this is where this has come from. There's a baby in there. Hello, baby. It's not a real baby, it's a plastic baby. Yeah. Why do you have flowers in the freezer? Who freezes flowers? No exit. No exit. Cheers. I'm trapped. I've always been trapped. Oh. Oh, I can't actually take this map. That's interesting. Can I, do I have a map? No. So I'm at 201, right? Which is here. Oh, it says you are here as well. I need to get to... So I can't get that way, so I'm just going to go and have a look in the other rooms, right? Hello. I'm sure that's nothing. Uh, to all villa residents, we have received many inquiries about the management of this building after the recent news. We would therefore like to hold a meeting to explain our policies more formally. We hope you can find the time to attend. Open. Did another door just open? Maya? No, I don't think Maya's in here. Don't be manipulated. Believe in your senses. I was just looking at a stream. Good. We'll repaint it all. Uh, why is something vibrating? Is this Maya? Did Maya do this? CB. Cherry Blossom. That's Maya's signature. Right. She's amazing. Oh, hello. The city's a blank canvas, begging for us to paint it with our hopes and dreams. I want to show the hidden side of girls, 
their impulses, their urges. Is that real? Was that real? What are you hiding inside? Or is this just really good on real? Don't engine? worry about what people think. I think it's I think it's live action. Be proud. I think it's live action. That's not. That's computer. <laughs> How could I ever be proud of myself? Oh. You can hear a baby crying. Or oh, gurgling, I should say. What am I standing on? Oh, it's a top. Uh, for a graffiti artist, spray paint and a blank wall are all you need. In Kettenstad, the walls of a particular apartment building are the canvas for several artists, with a new piece showing up every day. Social media star C.B. features her work there. Uh, given her passion for flowers, it's only fitting that her name C.B. Uh, and her name is C.B., which is short for cherry blossom. CB's art continues to captivate the hearts of the young, so we reached out to her for comment, keeping her eyes fixed on the new piece. She had this to say to us. All I'm doing is showing what these girls feel on the inside, but can't show on the outside. If any of them connect with a girl in the art, it's probably because they're experiencing the same thing. CB added that the flowers she depicts on the young girls, she paints bloom out of the scars that they bear. The flowers represent the girls overcoming past traumas, or at least their desire to do so. Princess Peace of 13, how you doing? Good to have you here. You've been having a good week. Everyone can see how talented she is. I couldn't be more different. Uh, baby silhouette? Not a not a pure fan of that. Oh no. That's not that's that's bad parenting, that is. Oh, it's there's a there's a big blood stain. That's unfortunate. Well, let's leave this room. No reason to stay here. Uh, what is going on my boat? Oh, a message. Hello, Amelia. Amelia, are you alright? Are you asleep? Are you asleep? Sorry if I woke you up. Didn't see. This is like simulacra. Didn't see you at the job yesterday. Still not feeling very good. Are you taking your meds? Sorry for the reply. I fell asleep. Reply. Don't worry about it. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm okay. I can. How fast do you text? I can actually get kind. Of, I can actually kind of get some rest now. I didn't mean to scare you or anything. Seriously, don't worry about it. All's good now. I'm still a little tired, but I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get up soon. Okay. <sighs> That's a relief. Okay. Always checking on your friends, people. Always checking on your friends. This looks this looks insane, doesn't it? Like this looks so good. Like I feel like I can smell this corridor. Is that a radio? Oh, that's a lot of Oh. Loser, liar, creep, stupid, creep, loser, insane. Okay. Getting a lot of negative vibes here, not gonna lie. What's with this place? Why all the sticky notes? Send you a sacrifice thing where it comes in different She things. never said anything nice. Is this a parental figure by any chance? What's this? Uh, child abuse slash neglect in Kettenstadt. A recent statistical survey has shown that the rate of child abuse in Kettenstadt last year was nearly double than the average of other developed nations in Europe. Number one. The recent economic strife and its resulting poverty are thought to be the cause. That's... There's no... That's... <sighs> shit parents, that's the cause. My mom loved me.
So this is a Silent Hill spin-off. Shockingly, I've never played a Silent Hill game, though I know I need to. They are very good. I, I very much enjoy them. I, we replayed for last year's um, Halloween streams. We replayed several of the Silent Hill games. Uh, not last week, last year, year before. Uh, we replayed several of the Silent Hill games. So this is Silent Hill, the short message, which just came out, I think, yesterday, I think. Um, and it's the first new Silent Hill game in a very long time. Um, let me just see what's on this corner. Oh, interestingly, nothing. Uh, I found, after playing them a couple of years ago, again with fresh fresh eyes, I found that Silent Hill 1 just does not hold up well. Silent Hill 2 is still good. Silent Hill 3 is probably the best. And Silent Hill 4, which I used to think was one of the better ones, is trash. Antidepressants. Just trash. I've taken enough medication. Well, sometimes you do need it for a longer time. Like, I'm I'm on medication. Uh, what are we on? I can't zoom in. Like, oh, I've taken that, I've taken that. Is there anything in here? No. Oh, good. Yeah, I, I have this feeling that this is building on the, uh, the PT demo that was released ages ago, the playable teaser demo. This may be, you know, maybe a fraction of what they wanted to release. Maybe this is what they wanted to release. Maybe this is all they were allowed to release. I don't know, but I have a feeling that they've taken that idea and sort of built upon it. I don't think this is going to be something that a lot of people this want to watch. Just, I'm just reading the room. Yep, yeah, just reading the room. Don't look, YouTube. I'm sorry. Yeah, don't look, YouTube. I'm sorry. Can I look away? No. Mom. Oh, mate. I'm sorry. I guess better. Trust me. Um, if anybody finds any of the content in this very disturbing and it uh, resurges emotions, um, then you can use exclamation mark help in the Twitch chat to get the link to a find a helpline website for your country. Can I actually leave or is this going to be like, now there's something chasing me moment? Oh, hello. Hi, Amelia. Uh, what about you, Anita? Anita, that's her name. What? You didn't look so hot the other day. Yeah, I'm fine. That's, that's 100%. That's, that's not a fine answer. You don't have to worry about me. Well, obviously I'm gonna. This is a good friend. Amelia is a good friend. Uh, I'm taking my meds. Meds are good, but what about therapy? No, it doesn't really do much to be honest. Now this is this is where I would I would stress that just because therapy doesn't work the first time or one time doesn't mean it's a it's a no go, it's a process. Talking to adults doesn't help. Some of our classmates were hospitalized. You don't have to do this alone. Oh what happened? I know. I'll let you know if I need anything. And those guys deserved it. Bit harsh. They feel bad, you know. All of them. I don't. I, I, is this like a carry situation that happened? Like uh, they did something bad and then they got their comeuppance? What is that noise? I wonder. Maya? It's not Maya. Oh, hi. <laughs> Can I? Uh, uh, oh, I can run. Oh, it's all gone all, all chain link. Oh, let's run this way. Uh, go, 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 go. Through the door, through the door. Oh, oh it's still running, still running. Still running. Where did it even go? What the fu 
fuck was that thing? Yeah, all very fair questions. <laughs> Are you there? I'm in the studio. You're actually here. <laughs> There's a monster here. Are you okay? No response. Absolutely no response. Can I go back out? No one's gonna. Nope. Okay. Cool. That thing might still be here. Uh, teenage suicides continue at infamous building. A rundown apartment complex in Kentenstad uh, has become known for its suicides, with teenage girls jumping from its roof practically every year. Despite recent events, the building, abandoned ever since the, depart uh, the development slash management company declared bankruptcy, remains easily accessible. The young and unemployed are not determined are not deterred by the building's grim reputation though, with many continuing to enter it. A young graffiti artist using it for their work, and young graffiti artists using it for their work. Meanwhile, local residents' security concerns continue to grow. More news at eleven. Please. Not Maya too. She has been acting weird of lately. Don't get she's just text you, mate. She's just text you, it's fine. Don't panic. She's just text you. Oh, another, another one of my Maya's graffitis. Cherry blossoms bloom within the grasp of death. With most flowers, the rot sets in, then they fall. That's the price of new life. Not cherry blossoms, though. They bloom beautiful, they fall beautiful. That's how I want my life to be. That's fair enough. Why is she not replying? Come on! I'm so I have to the find her. The picture in the background to change. I don't know, is there a book? Can I look at the phone? No, I can't. Oh, I can zoom in. They just had to click in the stick. Oh, my days. Uh, sorry. Horror music. Did we... Did we trip over something? Uh, oh, there's lots of talismans on this door. Oh, no. Oh, no. I wonder if this is uh, tied into or anything to do with Silent Hill F. Because the mention of cherry blossoms, the sort of um, uh, Asian iconography in regards to the talismans and stuff like that. Oh, now I can leave. Okay. Is it like... Is there going to be something here? Wait. Was that me shifting, or was that something else shifting? I don't know. I don't like it. I think it was me shifting. That monster. It's gone, right? Sure, why not? Where is the studio? That's a very good question. Don't know. We didn't take a photo of the... We didn't take a photo of the map. Very good sort of messy debris here, like this. Can I go outside? <gasps> I can go outside. Oh, hello. Oh, the famous suicide spot. Oh, wow. Oh, wowzers. God, this is a good looking game. It's running surprisingly well as well. I know it's on console, but it's still running surprisingly well. Uh, inside the fog of social media, solitude and anxiety in teenagers. All of the teenagers interviewed said that they were ashamed of the risque selfies they posted online. They also claimed they experienced anxiety over not getting any likes on such photos. I feel that every time I post a video on YouTube. Uh, what all the kids had in common was extreme low self-esteem. Thanks, game. Uh, the greater their anxiety and lower their confidence, the more pronounced their reactions were to positive attention. It's true. 
Uh, the sense of fulfillment they experienced after getting a like online is different for adults to comprehend. It's difficult for adults to comprehend. It's, it's the dopamine effect. It's the dopamine economy. Uh, therefore, even when acknowledged, the teenagers could still not view their actions positively and quickly reverted to despair, seeking more attention to fill the void. Teenagers who are not yet psychologically mature run the risk of experiencing this toxic quest for validation. Thanks, game. It's, it, it, that's interesting, because it's plugged in. Like, it's... It's literally plugged in. <laughs> yeah, measure mode. I'll plug it in differently. It's, but it's low! It does that every time. I still haven't disabled it from... Do that instead. I'll just lean forwards a bit. How about that? There you go. Now you're actually plugged in. Right, anyway. Um, it does that. Whenever you watch a DVD, it, 20 minutes in, it'll be like, you'll be like a really tense part of the movie or something like that. And it'll just be like, the DualSense controller has been disconnected. I'm like, cheers. And it's always that slightly loud noise, like, because you've had to turn the TV up or the sound bar up or something. You just like, it jumps out at you. What was, that? what was that weird noise? Okay, this this feels like late night delivery. If they made a HD remaster of late night delivery, it would look like this. Late night delivery? I'm sure it's called late night delivery. That Chiller's Art game that we played. Just so you know, it's running low. Just so you know. I had to squint then in order to see down the corridor. Eh. That's how squinting works. Eh. Ooh, pretty. <laughs> Wait, hang on. I've got a screenshot button. Oh, yeah. I don't know if it just worked, but I've got a screenshot button. Creepy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, uh, I hope you're all right. Can I run? No. Oh, hello. It's Amelia. By the way, there's a monster in the building. Oh, have you thought any more about college? I can't do it. You don't have to decide right away. So, once you're at college, you're not coming back here. No way, I'll come back occasionally. My parents would give me shit if I didn't come home for breaks. But yeah, just give college some more thought, okay? I told you I can't go. It's not for me. Studying isn't my thing. I told you I would help you. It's fine, I can't do anything. Don't know what I'd do if I got in. That's not true. You're way too hard on yourself. How fast do young people text? Be proud of who you are. Wait, what about those drawings you showed me? You could audit an art class. It could lead to a job. I'm not Maya, okay? Emily doesn't get it. Emily, not Amelia. Emily. Gotcha. I'm bad with names. So you don't really like this place. I get it. People in this town see graffiti as nothing but trash oh, doodles. And my classmates talk about me. Might not be a Post bad it. idea to leave town, actually. The great thing about graffiti is the world's your canvas. And as long as I'm with you, I can have fun anywhere. Is that us being a bit There's creepy? No or was that to... something else being a bit creepy? I don't know. So I'll just turn the lights down a bit so I can get a bit more atmospheric. Look how dirty their phone is. Jeez. I love and hate little details like that. CB. Cherry Blossom. More paint cans. 
Hello? Hello? Maya, are you here? Is this your studio? Oh, it's saving. What's this? Examine. Oh, a sketchbook. Are these Maya's sketches? These aren't even finished. <coughs> and they look this good. They seem happy. A new life. So full of life. It's gonna get real weird and creepy now. Oh no, maybe it's not. Chat, Maya. Are you here? Maya? This place is dangerous. We need to go. Maya, respond, please. Why won't she reply? Where are you? Oh, it's Am I the, going crazy? It's the Hitchcock zoom. <laughs> Can I not re-look at that? Because there was a picture I didn't look at at the end. Of a, what looked like a boy. Oh, hello. Ah. Oh. <laughs> well, show us a sign. <laughs> right, who's in the van? Let's go get some EMF. We've already seen dots. That's incredibly dangerous. Don't pour a cooker on top of a cooker. Like, even if one's broken, don't do that. Bet it's you. Did you post this too? <laughs> Even more followers. I lost followers again. Hard relate. <laughs> Some new followers here. stuff like this to get as many likes as Maya. Sexy. Loving it. Stop with the boring photos already. Oh, it's the comment section. Of course it is. No sexy stuff. No followers. Wow. Hate your followers. Congrats on reaching your follower goal. Come on! We want sexy stop. pics already! Just stop! Please! Ooh, an actual phone call. She spins. jumped from the villa. Why did she have to die? Maya's dead. There's the twist. There's the twist. Wait. Maya's really dead. Uh, how? How could I forget that? Are you all right, Anita? Hello. Hello. Hang up. No. Who's this? To go quite who is this? Find it. Find it. Keep it secret. Oh. Keep it safe. I've just realized that the uh 
cable I unplugged earlier is laying on my keyboard. I have no idea what that's just done. I could be offline right now and I wouldn't know. I thought that that was a thingy, uh, Heaven's Night um, uh, sign then. I was so tempted to get one of those for the back. That's the bar in Silent Hill 2. I was so tempted to get one. No. Oh, oh, it's all, oh so... So that's interesting. Instead of the radio static, we've got sort of we've upgraded, and now we've got glitchy effects and a broken cell phone. Uh, are we running this way? Is this a thing? I assume so. Uh, hi. Are you? Oh dear. Oh dear. Where am I going? Where am I going? In here. I have a, a, a definite feeling that I need to run. Because the game lets me run. <laughs> oh. This is what anxiety feels like. Oh my god. Ooh. I don't know what you you're you're a, a horror nasty. <laughs> oh, that's okay. It's, we've we've Prince of Persia it. It's okay. That didn't actually happen. We just passed out. That's fine. That's fine. Is this a d dream? Yes, probably. Or a catatonic state led by substance abuse or overdose. Two eleven. Let's just go straight in here. Go straight this way. Now, was I just too late, or do I need to wait? Oh, maybe. I need to Oh, no! Got me again! I just want to see them again, I'll be honest with you. They look a bit like, what are the, the big things that are Silent Hill 3? The big, the big things with massive hands. The big sort of hulking ones. Am I going crazy? <laughs> Mr. Cherry Blossom Hands feels pyramid head adjacent, yeah. All right, let's, oh god, that's the wall. All right, so you're going that way. Fine, I'll go this way. I'll go this way. Because then you come through this door here. All right, yeah. Oh god, you move faster. Hey, go through here. Go through here. Go. Run, 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 run. Get looped. Get absolutely looped. Whew. I'm currently feeling a little uneasy about having a tattoo with cherry blossoms on right now. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. I'll just go for you first. People do notice you. The world is better for having you in This is where this is I where jumped home. from. Bad things happen because of you! No. No. <laughs> Maybe I can be like her. Here goes. Don't look YouTube, it's not what it looks like. No! Oh, God, oh Lord.
That was heavy. That was heavier than I expected. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot heavier than I expected. If you are if you are in need of a helpline, you can use exclamation mark help to use the find a helpline service. Um, or you go on findahelpline.org if you don't want to type that into chat. What are we PTing for? Oh. But why didn't I die? It's an excellent question. And he, uh, why didn't you die? Maya's picture changed? Did you find it? Find what? Can't leave till you find it. Is this really you? Can't leave till you find it. Maya's dead, you're not her. Can't leave till you find it. I have a feeling this is going to be a running theme. Who the fuck is this? Can't leave till you find it. Can't leave till you find it. Tell me. What the fuck? Find what? What are we looking for? I hope it's not something very specific because I have not been looking too hard. I have been glancing around. Oh, oh. no. Oh, no. Battery. Oh, well, that's unfortunate, isn't it? <laughs> Right, so we got this one. Do I just need to... Oh, good grief, this is dark now. Is there going to be... Huh. Bad girl gets an empty plate. Bad girl gets an empty plate. Wow, Mother of the Year award. It's a nominee right there. Mm. Apparently, you still need to charge your phone in purgatory. God, that's tough. Yeah. Hello. That's nice and bright up there. Can I just go over there? Well, maybe I don't want to go to the roof, actually. Oh, a swinging light. I wonder if something's going to appear in it. It didn't. Oh, I'm impressed. God, that's that right there. That is a, that is a good scene. That's, that's nice. That's real nice. What's this? Inspect. It's all your fault. It's not uh, your fault, mate. It's not at all. This is all your fault. Bad things happen because of you. Because of you. It's not true. No, oh, we'll repaint it all. It says exactly the same thing. Okay. Is this going to be... Oh, no. Hey, a torch. Oh, someone defaced her thingy. It's all your fault, loser, slot, uh, ugly. That's unfortunate. That was a really nice picture as well. Uh, I can't pick that up. All I now know is that it's been defaced. So I wonder if I can now leave. Wait, what's in here? Nothing. It's a ladder. It's not a thing to store items. <laughs> well, I suppose it's you could. Locked. Oh, it's locked. Oh, okay. It looks like I actually do have to do something in here. That noise is good. I don't know if you can hear that. Oh, do I have to look at it? I have to look at it, possibly. I have to really, really take what? it. What? <sighs> Who would do this? Do I now get to leave? Oh, is this... Wait, was this trash here before? I don't think this trash was here before, was it? No, this trash was definitely not here a second ago. No word of a lie, our neighbours used to have a dartboard and it took us about two hours to figure out what the hell the noise was. Because all you'd hear was three rhythmic taps and then nothing for like two, a minute and then three rhythmic taps. We, we thought for the first, I'd say, hour or so of them doing it, we thought we had a leak. 
Oh, someone to face this one too. Can I go out here? Because this was all. Oh, Wait, come on. Oh, it's back on. It's back on, like magic. Uh, how could somebody do this? Oh dear. Some people really have nothing That's, better to do. It's very Wait. true. I bet it was these guys. Whoa! <laughs> Hi, you alright? Uh, I would like to leave, please. I'd like to... Oh, they're fake! Oh, okay. How the hell did they all get there all of a sudden? Aha. Uh -huh. That was that was creepy. I genuinely thought that was that was people then. Wait. What's this? It's a big hole. It looks like a big hole anyway. Or we're just looking at the thing that says all your hole. I'm not sure. But this I think this is where we saw the ground earlier with all the flowers. You know, the, the concrete splash zone. Oh yeah, no, it's a it's a it's a big silent hill hole. Anything? Anything new and spooky in here? No, no, nothing new. Oh, hello. This is just like before. Oh dear. Are you feeling okay? Good enough to get out of bed. Sorry for being a bad friend. You're not a bad friend. So is Maya really dead? That's a realistic time. That's a realistic texting time. Uh, why are you asking that? Please tell me. I still can't believe she's gone either. I wish it were a lie. She seemed perfectly fine before it happened. So Maya really is dead, yeah? Anita, are you okay? Are you getting enough sleep? Kinda. I'm taking some really good meds. Meds are good, but what about therapy? It doesn't really do much to you're be honest. You're so good to me, but you're leaving me behind. Maya really didn't tell you anything. No, she all she talked about was a book she read recently. Still, I feel guilty for what happened. Even if she didn't tell me anything, I should have known something was up. Did Maya really not well. say anything? Like, at all? Ah. So what'd you think of the book? The author killed themselves. They were young. Something beautiful from something tragic. It's kind of enchanting, isn't it? Not really. I wonder what they were thinking. Why right is Emily avoiding the question? Seems so. <laughs> anyway, More post its I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in a letter. You really are shy, aren't you? Actually, kind of like that though. Oh, she kind of likes us. You write in a really flowery and passionate way. It's a lot of post its Someone had to stick all of those on that wall. I can't wait to read more. Oh. I think she likes us. I don't think those like us, but I think she likes us. Oh, okay. Letters. Princess Pizza, same. <laughs> my desk, my uh, monitor currently resembles a bit of a sunflower because uh, it's got so many post-its around it. <laughs> yeah, lesson souls. Yeah, definitely. More, please do this thing. I've got a new, we've got a new uh, chant in the house. Drink the coffee, do the things. Just when we know we're not doing something we should do, it's like drink the coffee, do the thing. Oh, the kitchen. If you want food, do what I say. Oh, great. If you want food, do what I say. 
I have fortunately never been through that sort of relationship with parents. I've been through a bad relationship with parents, but never like that. I can only imagine how heartbreaking that is. In Japanese culture, there has long been a sense of beauty and sacrifice, with Harry Carey killing oneself by slicing one's stomach being the prime example. Uh, the idea was that by taking your own life, you symbolically purge the world of your transgressions and purify yourself. This concept can be confusing to many Westerners, with young people incorrectly assuming Japanese yearn for a beautiful way to die. Do we know for sure it's their mom? You might have missed something. I might have. Yeah, well, I'm assuming it's the mother. She's not said anything like, you shouldn't have been born or anything like that. Uh, modern Japanese people, however, do not view suicide in such a positive light anymore. They and the life they value is not a biological variety, but rather a social one where death is indeed to protect that life. Death is needed to protect that life, sorry. I see. So build up social media following, kill yourself, and then preserve that social media impact imprint. That's bananas. But at least I understood it. Foggy. I can see other buildings. How exciting. There was a... Um, I can't remember which one it was now. Uh, homecoming? Where it was set in an apartment building? That one was absolute toss. Absolute toss. But that's what it reminded me of just then. Uh, teenage suicides continue at infamous building. A rundown apartment complex. Oh, we've we've read that one. My interpretation since starting to watch has been that it's her own, like, inner self-talk. Oh, right, so it's her self-hatred. Got it. I think it's because it sounded so different. It didn't make me think that. And, like, if you want food, do as I say. It feels like a very kind of toxic parental thing to say, you know? Yeah, well, I, well we don't know, do we? We will find out. I hope, anyway. No more talismans on this door. What are they? What are they trying to keep in? This looks like somewhere you would lock a sick child. In in Japanese culture, you would lock away a, a physically or mentally disabled child, put talismans on the door, and try and purge the demon out of them. Are these candle holders or? Oh yeah, they're candle. Are they like alien stones? <laughs> wow, so many dribbly candles. Look at all the drip. You want your dribbly candles? We've got your dribbly candles right here. We've got them all shapes, sizes, colours, all sorts of dribbly candles. We've got your cultist paraphernalia. What's this? Uh, belief in the witch. My wife's cooking food. Oh my god, the house smells amazing. I'm very aware I've not eaten in six and a half hours. Belief in the witch of Kazakhstan, or Ketanstat, as I say. <laughs> dribbly is such a goofy word. Dribbly candles. These aren't just your ordinary candles. These are dwibbly candles. Uh, those who believe in belief, those who believe in the witch of Kettenstad share many practices with modern Wiccans, uh, such as praying for a bountiful harvest and goddess worship. There's a lot more to modern Wiccanism, but I'd like that slide. Uh, what sets the practice apart is its slight blend of both Western and Eastern customs. As for what led to a mixing of customs, there is one rather creative theory. During a joint efforts by Japanese and German entrepreneurs and labourers in the 1930s to foster economic growth and prosperity, there was an exchange of cultural beliefs giving rise to the belief in witches. An interesting interpretation. Wonder what those guys are talking about. Uh, fortune stains, telling? Probably. A lot of people are getting into that. Huh. You don't believe in that stuff? Well, I think there's something real about it. My great grandmother was a fortune teller. I'd love to have that in my past. I hear people here used to treat her like some sort of prophet. But they all eventually turned on my great grandmother. Guess you can predict other people's futures, but not your own.
yeah, I'd love to have that. I'd love to have, like, oh, my great-grandmother was a seer or a shaman or a witch or something like that or a fortune teller. That would be cool. I mean, in fairness, my mum was a witch. So, that, I mean, it kind of fits. <laughs> Tarot cards. <laughs> no point predicting my future. Not with that attitude, it's not. Is there anything new in here? I've I've legitimately got a tarot card, don't I? I've got D and D tarot cards that I'm gonna I'm gonna frame. Anyway, I'd like to say that won't make the YouTube edit, but it's already on YouTube, so oh well. Is it, I mean, we've been the other way. Is it now this way? What does this remind me of? This, this, all, this entire thing just gives me a strong vibe of something I remember. And I don't remember what it is. It might, it might be PT. Maybe I am thinking of PT. The trash room. Mm. Trashy. Stinky. Uh hate filled notebook oh good oh god we've all got one of those haven't we uh this is all your fault everything you're a heartless bitch you stole my only friend my place in this world all of it and you don't even care i'm invisible to you i fucking hate you <laughs> you have a really beautiful set of tarot cards in like black and gold with skeletons and dead things on them oh excellent you still can't read them but maybe someday yeah i've got like three books on how to read them died around the house because I've gotten like collectible tarot card sets. I used to be able to read them quite well, but yeah, not anymore. Don't, when I was an edgy teen goth. Uh, you're not talented. You're not special. You call those shit stains art. You came out of nowhere and ruined everything. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Fuck off, fuck off. <laughs> Gotta get the right amount in there. Get the fuck out of my life, you piece of shit freak. Beautiful. I, uh, is that moving, that bag? Or was that me? No, that's moving. Yeah, that's... That's moving. I <laughs> didn't know my inner monologue made it into a video game. It's fucking same, mate. Like... <laughs> but it is, it's probably been a little while since my inner monologue's been that that severe. I think a lot of therapy has helped me put a lot of coping mechanisms in place. And there's a baby in the bath. Uh, anyway. Um, Deutschland Medical University School for Medicine or Orientation. Not orienteering. That's what I wanted to say. Uh, dear incoming freshmen, welcome to Deutschland Medical University. Founded in 1709, Deutschland Medical University is one of Europe's oldest and most revered institutions. Its state-of-the-art research facilities eagerly await your arrival. Orientation details, uh, September 2021, School of Medicine. Please wear a mask when attending. This is for the college Amelie wants to go to. Oh. Hi, Amelie. Hi, Amelie. Hey, you got a minute to talk? Sure, what's up? You seem kind of out of it before. If something's bothering you, you can let me know. Thanks, but I'm fine. I'm just trapped in a hellscape with a monster chasing me. It's fine. So I had to bring it up. Don't want to pry. No, it's okay. I don't mind. Hey, we should go shopping together sometime. I haven't left my house in what feels like forever. Plus, my brother's coming over. Oh, right. You okay? Yeah, I'm just going to try and avoid him as much as possible. So shopping, yeah? We can find you something cute. No, I'm good. I'm not a fan of crowds. <laughs> Same. <laughs> and nothing looks cute on me anyway. Oh, mate. Stop talking like that. You're way too hard on yourself. You've got the looks. You just need to find the right outfit. Too okay. hard on myself, huh? Amelie's the only one who thinks that. Well, you when you're too hard on yourself, you're the last person to get out of that. I've seen that picture before. You're the last person to stop thinking that. Everybody else thinks it, and eventually you stop thinking it as well. Ruffled shirts. That's a... Oh, no, wait, are they... Yeah, no, they're ruffled shirts. Or they're sweaters, I'm not sure which. Uh, college prep diary. 
I haven't been able to study since my brother came back from Christmas break. He's nice and doesn't interrupt my studies or anything, but I can't stand him staring at me. Brother is suspicious. Brother's a weirdo. I know he was probably just messing with me back then, but I've been scared of him ever since. It's made me hate any guy looking at me. I can't believe other girls walk around school and town showing so much skin. I think I'm finally finding my study groove. My test scores are really good. Hmm, yeah. I oh, don't know. Uh, I'm worried about how much my parents are fighting recently, though. They were yelling at each other again today. I asked Mom why, but she wouldn't say. This is it. Test day tomorrow. Mom told me I should be proud of myself since I've worked so hard, so I'm feeling great. She's not my real mom, but I know she loves me, and I love her. Aww. <laughs> Healthy relationship. Mom, I'm going to ace this test tomorrow for you and Dad. Yay! Wholesome and horror in one diary entry. <laughs> We've come full circle. Uh, what's through here? Let me guess. Something horrific. This looks like... Is this going to be Amelie's room? Uh, this is college prep diary October to November. I'm finally focused on my studies. Uh, so I think I might pull an all-nighter. I won't... It won't be good for my skin. I can hear people calling me troll and nerd, but I don't care. I have to make it to college. I have to make it to college in the city. Mom and dad are counting on me. Try again. Pop my teeth back in. Uh, Mom and dad are counting on me to do well. I'll make them proud by getting into my first choice. All right, time to hit the books till morning. Dad was talking today about how there was a plan to rebuild the town. They were going to use a bunch of funding from China to turn the town into something better, but everything got cancelled due to COVID. Fucking everything got cancelled due to COVID. Uh, sure, it would have been nice if it had gone through, but they just couldn't see it happening, even if things had worked out. Uh, not in this place. It hasn't been special since I was little. There's something to do. There's nothing to do. The buildings are ancient. It's a dump. It legitimately sounds like my hometown. I'm not. <laughs> it's not. It was special when I was small. Like, now it's just a dump. Uh, my future isn't here. It's in this city where college life is waiting for me. Everything's riding on my entrance exam next year. I have to get out before my brother comes back. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I got a horrible, I got a horrible tummy feeling about this. I think the brothers are wrong and... Can I open the closet? No, good. Kind of don't want to. I think these ones might be Amelie's because she's so set on getting into college, right? I think. Stay home alone! Yeah, yeah, there's the brother connection as well in text message. We're piecing it together. We're piecing it together. Is this another prep diary? Yeah, college prep diary, August to September. I've got some materials from my first choice in the mail today. I'm going to I'm going to be a college freshman. I'm so, so happy. I still can't believe it. Mum, Dad, I'm going to study my ass off and be the best daughter ever. Thank you so much for everything. Mum and Dad are yelling at each other. They're talking about bankruptcy. Wasn't everything supposed to work out even without the rebuilding plan? Uh, so this means they're out of money, right? Does this mean I can't go to college? All that hard work was for nothing? No way. Don't leave me, Mum. I can't stay here. I can't be stuck here with my brother. September 23rd. Mum just left. She told me to get out of the way. I have to get out of here. I want to disappear. But where do I go? This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. Only hated the way her brother looked at her. Yeah. I bet she wants to leave to get away from all that. It'd be interesting to know what date it is like now, if that makes sense. So I know we know a reference for this. Like, was this a long time ago? Was it very recent? Oh, another diary. Oh no, a news article. Uh, young student found dead, possible suicide, September 25th. At around 10 a.m. on the 24th, a local resident reported seeing an 18-year-old female high school student fall from a roof of the Kattenstadt uh, apartment building. The girl was rushed to hospital, but pronounced dead two hours later. According to school staff, the girl was distraught over not being able to attend college due to troubles at home. 
Oh no. Uh, no, no, or diary was found, but police still believe her death may be a suicide. Amelie's not like this, though. Right? I think Amelie's also. I think Amelie's also taken the, the, di the big dive. Right, so that's everything, right? Yeah. I think we may just be in some sort of state where we don't really know what's going on. Is that a thing I haven't read? Don't really know what's going on. Uh, no, I've read that one. Open! Oh, God. I thought there was going to be something behind that then. Uh, so which way do we go now? I'm going this way on a... Gee, thanks. I'm going to just go this way instead first. See if we can get any more juicy law nuggets. Any law? Got any diary entries for me? I can hear someone singing. Oh, we're back at the studio. So I can hear someone singing, but I can't get through. Okay. I wonder if Amelie person who wrote that, I hate you, your art is shit, no. I wonder if Amelie hated uh, Cherry Blossom, because Amelie and Anita were best friends. This is a very bright corridor. Good grief. Oh, oh great. Oh, lovely. Just where we all want to be, back at school. This is a good looking school, though. Oh, I like the depth. If I look up, the floor at the bottom of the screen gets slightly blurry. I don't know how much that's being picked up on, on stream. And if I look down, it comes, it sort of snaps into focus. That's real nice. It does look so unbelievably good. This, this is a, this is a very, very good looking game. And it runs surprisingly well as well. Like I said before, I know it's on PS5 and I know you, you expect it to run good. But I also expected it to run a bit... I don't know, maybe because it's a not a demo, but maybe because it, it feels like it's a short game and it almost feels like it should run a bit juddery in places. I don't know. There's this expectation. I have this expectation that if it runs a bit juddery, it's fine. But I didn't expect it to run this smooth. This is like butter. Oh, great. I I did not like school at all. At all. I did not like Damn. school. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Go away! Just, just walking through. Not... Not bothering anybody. I'm guessing this is my desk. Can I read this? No, I can't. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Do I sit down? Do I go to class? Oh, I go to my locker. That's where I go, of course. It's this one. What the hell? Get out, you freak! Slut! Your art's fucking You're a freak. weird! Copy piece of shit! Abhor bullies. Being a victim of bullying, I absolutely abhor. Oh wow! Oh wow! That's a, a horrible but very effective effect. Shut 
your horn mouth! Ugly! More post -its. Get out, you freak! Uh. Whenever it says dumb, my brain's just like dum 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 dum. talking about Maya. I think they were talking about you, but okay. Okay. What if she's Maya? What if she's Cherry Blossom? Uh, okay. Does that mean I go through here now? Oh, great. It's hunting. Quick, find a locker. Uh, oh wow, good eye effect there. No, no, I'd like to leave. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. I gotta, I gotta go. Yo, this way. Thank you, game. Thank you, flashlight friend. No, oh, not that way. Stop. Just stop. Yes, please stop. Oh, you're a bit close. Let's go this way. Now go this way. Oh, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. It's all right, that didn't happen, it's fine. It's fine, that didn't happen. That was super fucking loud. That entire section was absolutely burning my ears me? off. Same brain blast, yes, exactly. Everyone relax, we're just PTing, yeah. We've done this before, people, we've done this before. We're seasoned vets now, we're seasoned vets. Every time we go through this sim a similar corridor loop, we refer it as PT. We even played the PT on PC a little while ago as well. There's a, a PC build for it. Oh dear, oh god. No, 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 Let's go this way, let's go this way, and this way, and this way. And do I go through here? I'm gonna guess I do. Oh dear. Oh, this is so good. Oh, it's behind me and to my left. The sound is really good, I like that. Oh, so when I unlock that, I move really slowly. Ha! Gotcha! Oh, PT came out around the same time you finally started getting into horror, which was nuts. Yeah, I bet it was. Uh, what a... Wow, what an introduction. <laughs> Find it. Find what? Find it. <laughs> Called it. Just tell me what I'm looking for. Find it. Please, what the fuck am I supposed to find? Your no help, mate. I love PT. PT has a very special place in my heart. Until very, very recently, I, uh, I had it on my PS4, and then my PS4 hard drive died. So I actually lost it, which is a real shame. But like I said, we played the PC port of it. Uh, I say port. We played the emulated version that someone had put on the internet a little while ago, which I think is still on the YouTube channel, I think. Pregnancy test, positive. Oh, I see. I see. It's, I told you it was you. This picture is Amelie. I don't think it's Amelie. Is it Amelie? 
I mean, it looks like our character. I'll be honest with you. Is there anything else? Is there anything else in here? Aha, now I can go through this. This guy looks familiar. Okay, okay. They're hurt. Where are you going? Yeah, that's right. Amelie. Is it though? <laughs> What's that? Oh, you like what you see? Come closer then. Wait a sec. You two are from my class. Those glasses look good on you. Uh, sorry, she's so cute. I couldn't help myself. Feel free to stop by any time. You're always welcome. <laughs> I mean, kind of cute. Kind of hurtful, but kind of cute. Maya only ever cared about Amelie. Oh, man. She didn't see me. I was invisible to her. Oh, so your official prediction is about DID and there's only one girl. That's the dissociative disorder, isn't it? Identity disorder, isn't it? Dissociative identity disorder, where people can have multiple identities in in their in their psyche. Um they used to call it split personality disorder, but now it's known as DID. Thank you. There were there's a there's a term for the different like ma faces, different personas that people have, and I can't remember what it is because I know someone with it, and I can't remember when they say, "Oh, you're speaking to to this this word now." I can't remember what it is. Uh, January thirty first. I haven't really been in a good mood since this morning. I tried to lose myself in my graffiti, but it, I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because Mom and I argued this morning. Probably not. We've clashed before, but known, f no, but known for a long time, we value different things. Alters, thank you. That's the word, alters. Is it because my classmates teased me? I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone. It's got to be because I lost that special person. It's got to be because I lost that special person and the hope he gave me, right? Why do I feel like this? never felt like this before oh, I see so she lost someone oh, wow Library. do you know this back at school. this makes me think that the next generation of horror games are going to be absolutely mind blowing there's no beauty any of this. Oh, oh, sorry. I was just thinking about something. Yeah, absolutely, Princess Pizza. I borrowed that book you wanted. What is the book? I'd love to know what I the book is. It. So it's all yours. Yeah, I need to get back into VR, Acris. I gotta admit, I haven't I actually haven't played it since upgrading my graphics card. So I wrote my impressions in a letter. Aw. Wait, no, is that wait. Read it when you get home, okay? Yeah, I think this is the same person. Because that's not Anita, is it? That's Maya. But Maya said to Anita that I didn't know you. You, you write so uh, eloquently and very passionately. Where was it? Hmm. That book. Is it this one, by any chance? Well, I, I mean, I want to have a bit of a look around first, I'll be honest with you, because this place looks amazing. Oh, my God. I'm really, really excited for games to look this good all the time. 
But also, can you imagine like playing an observation duty game with this uh, this level of detail? It, it feels like a library. You're not wrong. You're not wrong at all. Like I stand over here. Like I'm so I'm so used. What did you know? The thing that gets me, the thing that gets me is I don't see enough repetition in those books. I see like similar styles of books, but I don't see like the same three shelves copy pasted, copy pasted, or just like the same ten books just copy pasted, copy pasted. That is mind blowing to me. This looks like a real book. This could be a photograph, for all I know. Like, if you were to show me this, I'd say, oh, you took a picture of a library. Like, there's there's a couple of bits that give it away, but not much. Like, even bits like this, like this, th there's always libraries, there's always a stack of encyclopedias somewhere. Like, always. This is crazy. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, Witch's Curse in impedes which is curse impedes progress uh kettenstad the town the town cursed by a witch malicious magic to blame for city slump kettenstad i bet what okay hang on let's just 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 sort of pause a second what if uh they're like oh not since the town was renamed to kettenstad from silent hill <laughs> <laughs> what if it's something like that? <laughs> uh, Kettenstad continues to see rapid decline in its population. The birth rate is a mere 0 0.7, less than half of that of German nation uh, average 1.6. Miscarriages are also at 31%, more than double the average 15%. The economy is in shambles, and the once booming industry, industrial city has failed to revitalize itself, blah, 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 failed to revitalize itself twice. A number of researchers studying the occult point to a witch <laughs> point to a witch as the cause of the economic downturn in Kenstad. Uh, the witch was a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance to influence economic development in the town in the 30s. Researchers believe she was hunted down and killed. Before her death, she's believed to have placed a curse on the town. Uh, st stimming? Stimying? I don't know that word. Stimying is growth. Stopping. Is a curse. There you go. But I've used the correct word for me? you. Why do I have to be cursed? Stymying. Like Learned a new word today. Stymying. Find it. 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 Tell me, is this your curse? Find it. Oh gosh, you're no help. Find what in a place like You're this? you're like the worst backseat twitch chatter. Like you really are. You're just like, find the thing, find the thing. Tell me what. There's always a delay as well. It's to your left. No, your other left. No, back where you were. No, back where you were. What if this game has no connection to Silent Hill besides that Silent Hill sells good? It'll sell good. That's that's it. It'll sell good. What I'd like, uh, I wouldn't mind it if they built more on the lore. They made it more supernatural because, like, they made it um, with the. Oh wait, this door was this door didn't have this on it before. Oh okay. Uh, they made it like not supernatural in the movies, and that suddenly became canon. It was like, oh no, it's all because of a fire in a mine. Like that's what caused all the fog, and it's actually ash and. There's no curse. It's just your, you know. There's no none of this. Is just just your own psychological disorders that are trying to hunt you and kill you down. Which I get. I totally get. But what I'd, it would please me to no end if they were like, Do you know what? Maybe we'll just put like a, a Japanese occult spin on this. Maybe, you know, in this universe that has happened, but other stuff has also happened that is linked to the supernatural, and there might be a little bit of crossover. I would, I would enjoy that to no end as a fan of the series. Where am I going? It's locked. Thank you. I know it's locked. Am I leaving via the window? Nope. Am I looking for a book? God, this library looks amazing. I thought that was something that's that is the reflection bottom right hand corner of my screen that is the reflection on the plastic on the outside of a book jacket <laughs> that's what that is 
Uh, do we know whose initials are CB? Uh, I think it's the Cherry Blossom artist, but I don't know if... So Anita obviously isn't CB, but it's that's normally a way to tell me that I'm going to her studio. I... Uh, uh, this is it is not obvious what I need to do now you have been very clear in making wait yeah I've read that okay okay I am looking for a book got it sapiens a history of humankind so how much how much of this can I read the English dictionary I don't want to read the English dictionary not again ah there it is thanks game uh, oh good the Witch Hunt of Kettenstad. Thank you for translating this for me. The in 1930s Germany, the town of Kettenstad. It's not. It's not Silent Hill. Uh, attracted wealthy entrepreneurs and enjoyed a period of economic prosperity. Behind that success, though, was a supposedly a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance and mystical powers to guide the entrepreneurs. She would come to be known as the Witch of the Far East and would be greatly respected by the German people. However, in 1947, the entrepreneurs suffered great losses. A large fire spread throughout their industrial parks, losing them the majority of their factories. The Witch of the Far East, who was hospitalized, jumped off the roof of the hospital and killed herself. The witch had been diagnosed with an unknown illness, and many believe the fires pushed her over the edge. Some citizens, however, claim that the witch hunt was to claim that a witch hunt was to blame. They argued that the witch's rise in prominence angered the mayor's party, who used the chaos of the fire to cover for a cover as a murder, as a cover for a murder. Even there is no evidence to support this claim, and many now view it as mere conspiracy theory. But the mayor's party did manage to regain influence in the town after the witch's death. I mean, I guess that was going to happen anyway. Uh, since then, citizens have started to believe any stroke of bad luck as a result of the witch's curse. Witch's yep. curse. Not Is economic downturn, not politics, before? nothing. Modern eating habits. Om nom nom. Can we, can we stop talking about food? Physics? I like physics. What's this one? Oh, what's this one? Oh, the English dictionary again. Okay, now I'm seeing repetition and sapiens. Okay, but still. Did that say Lauren? As in Lauren Ipsen? No, okay. Now can I leave? It won't open. <laughs> yeah, it's not like there's a giant world war involved in these countries at any time or anything. No, that had nothing to do with the economic downturn. It was the witch. <laughs> it was the witch. What did it? Uh, do I need to read this again? Wait. No. That's the same thing. I can't trust that it's going to stay the same thing. If that makes sense. Are there any other books that I need to read? Let me, have, let me look down as I walk around now. I've looked up. Now let me look down. Thought that was a shiny book that I needed to read. It's not. It's just very good lighting effects. Are there any other books I need to read? Aha! This right here. Looks like there's space for a book here. Wait, I think I know these. Uh. No. Damn it, I have to go back and get it. <laughs> Scribble's notes, which responsible for no World way. War II. Got it, yeah. Anything bad happens, it was a witch or wizard. Uh, I still wait for you, volume two? Volume two. Unless it's following the Garden of Banban approach to releasing volumes, and then it goes one, two, three, five, seven, six. <laughs> and then four is never released. Aha! The door is opened. I've done the thing. Excellent. That corridor! Oh my days! I mean, I did learn history in America, so at this point. <laughs> I just, I, I'm the sort of person who appreciates brickwork in games, and I 
really appreciate this brickwork. I don't know why. I just, I don't like it when it's just bricks.png. Oh, God. Oh, that's a lot of post-its. That's a lot of post-its. It's like that other school. This has happened before. Why does this always happen? So, I've never seen like that before. we've got, if this is dissociative identity disorder, we've got, I mean, they look very similar as well, don't they? Uh, you left me on red, so I was worried. Sorry, I was just thinking about Maya. Not sure if you know this, but Maya was bullied at school. I know. But she said she was okay. Is that something we didn't know that that Amelie did. I figured I shouldn't push the issue. Then it was too late. Why didn't she say anything before she died? I wish she'd have talked to me. Maybe she didn't see me as a friend. We just gonna leave her like that? Like, are we just gonna be like, yeah, yeah, probably. Close. <laughs> That's not true. Say that. Just that, that's like a few letters. Just say that. That will ease that person's anxiety and worry. So we've got Anita, who basically is the manic depressive. We've got uh, Amelia, who is the study focused college wanting nerd, right? That's totally fine. That's not a, dis that's not a disparagement. Um, and we've got Maya, who is the creative. Uh, very free spirited kind of spiritual occult loving um, uh, uh, creative creative one of the three so yeah so those are three very different personalities so it could be the same person with three different personalities or I say person three different identities that would be really good if it was because they, they've already layered on quite a few different uh, real life mental illnesses you know so it's entirely possible. Yeah, exactly. As far as what you understand, they also can converse with each other as well, and sometimes they see and experience things to another or that another alter won't. At least that's what you're saying. Yeah. So, uh, as I was saying earlier, I know I do know somebody with DID um, passively, if that makes sense. I don't know them like they're not they're in constant contact, but I do know them, um, and they've explained it like some of them can have conversations on their own. And it's a, it's a, oh, what, did, what did she say? It's a, it's a room full of people that they're not all talking to each other. Some of them are talking together. Some of them aren't, but every now and then one of them's in charge. Like one of them gets to drive the meat suit. <laughs> so I'm sure that's what she said. Uh, what? So I need, oh, is it in here? Maya's locker. Mm. No, it's not here. It wasn't here before mm. either. Mm. Oh, no. Don't like that. Lots of blood. Which the photos of her and Amelia. Uh, Amelie, sorry. I've called her Amelia so much that it's now... Oh, the, oh, there's lots of razors there. Oh, dear. Right, so why did we open her locker earlier? My locker. Why is it locked? Is there something I don't want to see? Do we know the code? I don't know the code. Uh. Amelie's locker. Aha. Yes. It's just a novel. Wait a sec. Mm, oh, I was going to say, has Wait. that now changed? Japanese novel. I like that I can read the little notes up there. That's pretty cool. Japanese novel, some, for, some pictures. Uh, I need that. I need... Well, what... Sorry, did I just miss something then? Did I miss a code? Or am I looking for another locker? 
Because I wanted that book, right? Oh, hang on. Two. One. <laughs> this, this is not... This is not helpful. Zero. What else have we got? Uh... Black, red, yellow, blue. Zero. Red. I need a red number. Where's the red number? Red number? Is it on here? No. Red number. We've got a blue number. We've got a black number. We've got a yellow number. I also need a red number. If I figured this out right. Hello. Red numbers? Nope. Red numbers, where are you? There was lots of red in this locker, so maybe it's in here. Uh, oh, maybe it's on the back of this. Nope. 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 In that one? Nope. I'd like to think it would be more obvious than this, but I have a feeling it's not going to be. Unless it's just down here. Maybe it's down here. It's on the back of something here. No, 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 no. I mean, we could brute force that. Uh, that's entirely possible. I'd rather not. I'd rather actually find the red... Ah, there it is. There it is. Three. So, three. So, it is zero, three, one, two. Zero, three, one, two. Zero, three, one, two. I know I'm We're insane. Inside. We can't be stopped. And I can't look away. Here it is. What's this letter? Was it inside the book? And who sent the letter? <laughs> Remember when I said I wanted to live like a cherry blossom? To be beautiful and dignified for a fleeting moment, simply by letting go of life. Daring to bloom, knowing it won't last. And so falling, in vivid color. I wish I could live like that. I want to experience true beauty, if only for a moment. I met someone who made me feel different. He showed me a whole new world, gave me hope. I honestly thought he could help me find a new me. I felt it with all my heart. But people didn't understand us. Didn't want that from us. In the end, they took my hope from me. They took him away. People, people who can't achieve beauty, seek comfort in others. They fear anyone different, hate them, try to tear them down. I can't take much more of this. I wish you and I had... I wish you and I could run away together, Amelie. Just me and you. That was, I don't know if that was purposeful or timed or whatever, but that was thunderous silence. That was beautifully done. Oh. Maya, she was asking Amelie for help, but I just, uh. Maya, you have everything. You're way more talented than me. So why? Why take Amelie from me? You acted like I wasn't even there. Amelie is my friend. She's mine! I only want 
wanted to take her down a bit. She she was taking Amelie away from me. She wouldn't pay attention to me. How was I supposed to know she'd actually kill herself? <laughs> Oh no. Where are the baddies? Uh, do I need to do something? I, I would have liked that book because apparently I need that book for that puzzle, but I'm going to guess I actually don't need that book. I'm going to guess that was just a way to get me here. I still disagree. I don't I don't think it's your fault. Oh good, it's chasing me. It's Anita's resentment at making uh, Maya hurt herself. Oh, hello. Oh that's very good. Lots of problems. Maya? Yes. Ah! This way. behind me. I'm going to see if it might be near me now. Hold it. Goddamn music. Got no right to go this hard. <laughs> I was just, I was just driving to the music. <laughs> yeah. Try again. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Notification noise never gets. Oh no, she's out. Oh, gotta go fight. Does this open this way? Yeah, thank god. here in front of me now. <laughs> yes, that knocking is my notification. I apologize. Oh god, I thought that was her. Ah, are we safe? Well, we're further on. Safe is, is relative, right? Shit. A quick turn feature, that's what this game needs. Uh, Dick's Insider 1577, how are you doing? It's good to have you on board. <laughs> so, 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 that is exactly how it sounds to myself as well, Princess Pizza. Are you here to punish me? You're alone here all day and you thought someone was outside your window. Yeah, well, I, I literally, this, this wall right here, it only comes out of this ear for me, and this wall leads to the spare room. So, like, that knocking legitimately sounds like someone knocking on the wall next to me. Can't be a spooky channel without spooky notifications, right? Let's go. 
Come on. No, I gotta leave. Oh, that's a chain link fence. I'd like to leave. I'd like to not leave anymore. Ah, the Crystal Maze game show has really taken a dark turn. Are you now going to be in front of me again? Because you sound like you're behind me. Spooky Shadow, good. Now through here. Now, I mean, you still definitely sound like you're behind me. Oh, no, it's a dead end. Don't do that to me. Nope, okay, cool. So now that's a dead end. I gotta go back this way, right? Oh! Oh, I'm stuck! Oh no, that's a dead end! Oh, come on. Did you move the blockers the wrong way? How very dare you? That's utterly ridiculous. Or just, you know, take a break. Like... Okay. Oh, 
Again, heavy. Another loop. Excellent. What? Oh, now where are we? But I jumped off the building. Again. Oh. Huh? Oh. That's us. Even if I die, this doesn't end. How many times do I have to go through this? Find it. How can I get you to forgive me? I mean, you're probably not. Please, my intel. Find it. Why won't you say something? So, why do we want to bet that we're going to end up crawling through this hole? This looks very silent, Hilly. Oh. Okay, this is more like what I was expecting. Oh, that body's gone. They sound cold. Uh, Maya's Diary 2, February 4th. I ended up heading to the roof of the villa and couldn't help but think of the girl who jumped to her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teens, supposedly. Now a place now the place is a famous spot for people to kill themselves. Sadako, wow, there's a name I've not heard in a while. Oh lordy. That bit where she goes around the corner at the end of the movie. Scar before weeks. Looking down from the roof, I could see how high up I was. The thought of the light breeze sending me flying made me feel a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Were they jumping away from something or to something? Oh, yeah, the original, the original ring. You saw the ring for the first time as an unprepared 10 year old and couldn't be alone for months. I am not surprised. I saw it as an unprepared, I would say, probably 19 year old. No, 17 year old. And I, I couldn't sleep for a very long time. So, yeah, I completely missed that. The grudge as well. The grudge. I think the grudge was probably the one I couldn't finish, like, that night in one sitting. I had to watch it the next day in the, in the daylight. I think that's probably why I find uh, Japanese inspired horror more frightening. There's obviously the cultural difference there as well, but it's probably why I find it so scary because it's it's all based on like the unknown and like mysticism and culture and like there's always a mystery there. Whereas Western horror is always like, oh, it's it's like Scooby Doo, right? It's like oh, you just take the mask off and it's Fred the Janitor who was doing all the murders. Or like, you, this never happened, you imagined it. Not like there's an unknown entity killing people or anything like that. Can I get through there? No. And then fun story time. I went to a sleepover a couple of years later when we watched it. And Japanese horror is the scariest, no contest. Yeah, 100%. Watched it and sat up at the end with my, no and my nose started bleeding. Everyone was afraid of me. No one would go near me. Oh, mate. Oh. That's gotta be that's gotta be something to go for. That's a No, it's fine. That's gotta be pretty rough. Sorry about that. No exit. I don't wanna exit, I wanna entry. more law. The Silent Hill Phenomenon. Suicide rate has increased around the world, in a large part due to the struggles brought on by the COVID-19 pandemic, with countries still unsure how best to handle the issue. These trying times have also given rise to a strange phenomenon in many areas. Those affected suddenly claim to see fog even on fair weather days, and lose consciousness shortly after. 
It has come to be known as the Silent Hill phenomenon, named after a similar event that occupied, that occurred in an eponymous, eponymous U.S. town. I don't. That's another word I don't know. I'm I'm reasonably well read, but that's another word I don't know. Uh, the first proposer theory explaining why this could be happening is Doctor Triple X. Wow. Um, a social psychologist at Triple X University who had the following to say on the matter. Uh, to one who is psychologically unstable, fog represents uncertainty and sensory illusions. When in a state of high stress, one's vision may become obscured or tunneled, as if, as if one is wandering through a dense fog or mist. Societal uncertainty and apprehension about the future manifests as fog, thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. Uh, as time goes on, we, see, we are seeing more and more cases of the silent hill phenomenon. Do, 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 do. Phenomenon. In response, Dr. Triple X calls for a rapid rebuilding of society as well as a stronger emphasis on counselling and mental health care for the young. Yeah, that's cool. Just a psychologist is just like, we should rapidly rebuild society. It's not like an entire generation has been saying that for years. This looks like a corridor. The, the layout is resemblant of a corridor from the hospital in Silent Hill 2 that I remember. There was a corridor that way, there was a corridor that way with a nurse's station, there was a lift there, and there was a corridor that way. This looks exactly like it. Yeah, thanks for your brilliant insight, insight, Dr. Triple X. Why had no one thought of that before? Nope, nothing here. Am I going to be in the hospital? Oh, brilliant. Can I hide? Wait, do I need to hide yet? The controller vibration is then what off the scale. I'm not used to controller vibrating that much. The controller vibrations on the the PS5 controller as well are really good. I didn't quite realize. Oh, handprints on the mirror. Excellent. That was like a face print on the top left. But someone just headbutted the mirror. Oh, it's eerily quiet. Eerily quiet. Yeah, the Dual Shock Five is incredible. Uh, what's the Astrobot? Astrobot's a really good game with the DualShock Five. I finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought I found my happy ever, happily ever after, but it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost everything. I still have my children, my cute little angels who bright up my life, who light up my life. Sorry, Lisa. Cursed photo. Yeah, Lisa. Sorry, Lisa's the name of the woman from PT. <laughs> yeah, Lisa's the name of the what the name of the woman from PT. Is that soda or beer? Beer, real beer, no less. Not fake beer, real beer. Oh, it was so, we're definitely PT now. Look at this. PT in an apartment. A, a, a part, a, a apartment. That, that, that works. Nailed it. It's also your mother's name, which is hilarious. Is your mother also a 12 foot tall demon lady? I'm just asking for a friend.
<laughs> yes, excellent. I'll DM you later. Um, anyway, moving swiftly on. Uh, diary of a sing di diary 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 of a single mother. My new man showed up to my place today with pizza. Children definitely need a father, but they still won't take to him. He looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. I can't. I cannot wrap my head around that. I I cannot wrap my head around. Obviously, that's an experience I'm never going to need to go through being a single mother. But like, get being that in being in that position and getting another person in your life. Um, my daughter. I can I can imagine myself in lots of weird and wonderful situations. But that's one situation that I just can't I can't envision. Uh, my daughter drew a picture of our family. We're smiling and holding hands. I wish she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She is slower than other kids her age. Fucking harsh. Uh, I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. Uh, I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. There's a running theme with the games I play. It's always child abuse and like... Fucking bad parenting. Layers of fear. This game. Insert other names. <laughs> this place has, has 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 been better. I'm not gonna lie. This this, this feels horribly reminiscent of like when my dad had a, a decline. Um. Right. What have we missed? What have we missed? Or do we need to go back up this way? No, I'm not out this way. Is there a jump scare incoming? Daughters and a mother, and yet no one puts the toilet seat down. That's shocking. Absolutely shocking. You should have your parent parental card revoked. Why won't you listen to a damn thing I say? Of course, I need the trauma drip. Stepdad is trash, apparently. Yeah. Mmm. I can smell this room. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands from the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza, though. She's extremely picky. I should probably teach her to eat things she doesn't like. Or, you know, tell the dude not to buy pizza anymore. I know, uh, I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. Nope, it doesn't. Uh, the kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with them. We need him, we need him for a happy life. And I need them to realize that. I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they will finally see the light in him. He took, wait, when was this? March, April. He told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? You shut them in a fucking closet. Uh, he doesn't visit as much as he used to. If I don't figure something out, he may never. I may never see him again. Right, yeah, you're insane. Straight in the bin. Straight in the bin. Absolutely straight to jail. Straight to child services. That's no pass and go. No nothing. Right to jail. That's it. Oh, we're tiny as well. We're, we're dinky. I didn't realize that. Oh, inspect. I'm giving up my life for you! Spooky picture. Spooky picture. Trauma response. Oh, good. Mm. Is that moving? It's not moving. It's leaking. So much worse. <clears throat> Everything seems to be going well now, and we've been going out on dates. He was worried about my kids, so he bought them a bunch of books and toys. Uh, that should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it. 
but by the time I get back, I have no energy. It's probably all the coke you're doing. Uh, I got contacted by Child Welfare Center. Good. I guess some nosy bitch or asshole in the building reported hearing a child crying at night at my place. The fuck do they know that you're a bad mum? Uh, he hasn't called me back much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is out enjoying life while I'm working my ass off raising kids. Why am I the fucking bad guy? Uh, exhibit A to Z. Uh, I could throw fucking numbers at any surface in this house and I could show, show the jury the, the reasons why. If I hadn't had children, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Oh, good. Parental resentment. Fantastic. Uh, nothing else. Uh, nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. Oh, no. Oh, ho. <laughs> the grim is stuck on my face during that entire part. Yeah, it's like... Oh. Don't you dare go outside. Stop! Baby in the fridge. Closet's behind me. <clears throat> Miss Krista Planet. We have reached out to you repeatedly. <laughs> that noise. That noise is incessant. Repeatedly, but have yet to receive a response. We take this to mean you have no intention of, remedi uh, of uh, remedying the issue. You're in violation of German Civil Code Article 1631 Section 2. Accordingly, the federal courts has been instructed to take your children. Should you have any objection to this, please contact us as soon as possible. Frank Kirscher. Ace. Is this... Oh, good. It's the closet. Are you moving? No, you're not. Oh, no, it's the sound of broken toys under my feet. That's what that noise is. Oh, dear. What happened in the closet? Come on. Oh, no. Oh, this is... Oh, I don't like this. Oh, dear. Boy found dead in refrigerator. Mother arrested. A boy was found dead today in a refrigerator at home of his 41-year-old mother. Person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. And when she noticed he wasn't moving the next morning, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are, concluding, are conducting an autopsy to determine cause of death. According to the investigation, person A's daughter ran to the neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested the mother after she confessed to the crime. You disobeyed me again! Oh, God. Fucking hell. It's time for the circle to open. Oh. Don't lock me in here! Let me out! Is that... Cherry Blossom Lady.
So the grandmother. You're wrong, Mom. I the grandmother was the witch of the Far East. 1930s. I'm just like you. I'm cursed. Hmm. Yeah, what what am I carrying? Oh my phone. <laughs> I'm like, have I got a knife? Why am I seeing this room here in the villa? It's the trauma. I tried so hard to forget this place. It's the trauma. Oh no, the fridge is open. I don't want the fridge to be open. That's the same, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it was a strong theory. Oh! <gasps> mirrors! People don't get how hard it is for game devs to do mirrors. They just do dirty mirrors. This that, That's pretty amazing. The reason it's hard for them to do mirrors is because there's no such thing as a reflective object in a game. No such thing. What they need to do is they actually need to build a second uh, room in a different space that's only visible through this. There's no such thing as a mirror in a video game. Oh, God. It's a pixelated... Yeah, well, it's a pixelated mirror, but it's still a mirror. The fact that it's not just, you know, a smudgy mess is a, is a good thing. Oh, I hate the idea of cockroaches. I have fortunately... Touch wood. Whatever. I've fortunately never had to see or deal with a cockroach in my life, and I hope that continues. Oh, good. That's that's a good sign. Oh, that's also a good sign. Oh, that's an even better sign. The light's flickering, it's saved, and everything's gone glitchy. Excellent. Do it. Wait, wait, no, go, no, go, no, I'm dead. Am I being chased by Autumn Leaf person now? Have you changed seasons? You, can't, you did kind of take me by surprise there, I won't lie. Let's just see if we can... I'm sorry, Mom! Don't you be sorry! Right, do I just gotta... Down here, there we go. Oh, that's very nice, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, I can't see I'm going. Ag, ag. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I got distracted by the floor. I got distracted by the Silent Hill floor and got lost. I ran into a dead end. Do over. Let's just roll that back, people. Roll that back. All right. This one's the one. This is the run. When I remember how to play video games. All right, let's go. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. Go to the closet. Uh, nothing in the closet, though. Oh, look, a loop again. Uh, I'm sorry, was that a picture of the mum on the screen? Oh, no, it's a picture of... Is that Maya or Amelia? Oh, the phone's doing creepy shit. I don't like that at all. Oh, no. Oh, there actually isn't anything this way. Shite. This one. This one. This is the run. This is, this is it. All that was just practice. I'm being thrown off by so much ambient stuff. I got thrown off by the floor. I got thrown off by the phone. This is, I, I gotta focus. I gotta get my head on. Everyone blames me. All right. I like the melting of the world as well. That's very cool. Right, this way, then this way. Don't look at the phone. Oh God, oh God. Yeah, you like the way the voice line changes every time. Yeah, that is pretty cool, isn't it? Stop looking at the phone. Stop looking at the chat. Wait for Spooky McDuff to come around the corner. Oh, my God. Oh, 
Oh, I don't think I wanted to go in here. I really don't think I wanted to go in here. There's a... What's that? What's that? Oh. You like what you I'd see? I have to collect things in here. No, 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 thank you. This way, please. No, thank you. I don't know where I'm going. I'm completely lost. Where am I now? Oh, cat. Oh, I just, I'm back in the room I was. God damn it. Oh, why, why do you invited you jokers? Oh, no. All right, hold her off. <laughs> this door, this door. That's what I want. This is the one. Yep, that's fine. Just going to go a little bit slower. That way, do you think? No, just run, just run, just run. <laughs> oh, it's very dark down here. I am not sure where I'm going. Oh, it's so dark. Here. Oh, a picture. Yay. I really like what you do, my Oh, my God. I have to. Oh, gosh, that. I have to collect the things to unlock the chains. That's what I have to do. Oh. Crap on a cracker. That is not fun. Do not give me a collection sequence in the middle of a chase sequence. Uh, I don't know where I'm in. Oh, this is the room I was in originally. Uh, giant, giant teddy. Maybe it's not. Yeah, there's no pressure. It's not like she's one hit kill or anything. Do you know what I mean? This feels like it's the wrong way. The wrong way. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm still stuck. Table? Ta no, not table. That's a toilet. Toilet, not a table. Is this is this a way though? Is this a way to go? Or is this a big loop? It smells like a big loop. Oh, Jesus. I don't even know where it is. Just run. Just run. Just run. Just run. Flee. Flee for your life. Pay no attention to the chat in the window. Pay no attention to the phone in your hand. Just flee for your life. What is this way? What is this way? Please, please give me pictures. Give me... Oh, is that one? That's going to be one, isn't it? That's like the school desk. Oh, no, apparently not. Apparently not. Oh, no, I don't know where I'm going. There. What are you hiding inside? I need to find two more, apparently. Oh, I don't know. Where is it? Where is it? It's there! It's there! Oh, I don't know. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. This way? No, that's the way I was a second ago. Bollocks. Are you going to come through that door? Or are you just going to appear somewhere? I think it might be the latter. Oh, hello. Look at all. That's it. Now, not flat, not right. Keep going, keep going. What's this way? This 
is the corridor I was in originally, I think. Yes. Maybe. Didn't go this way, though, did I? Big light, big light, big light. You're way too hard on yourself. That's it, we've done it. Now I need to find that door and not die. I'm sorry, Mom. Well, don't be sorry. I have no idea where this door is. Oh, are you there? Oh, oh, I'm lost. Oh, shite. No! Please, please tell me I don't need to collect those photos again. Please tell me I don't need to collect those photos again. I do not remember. Aha. Is this a photo? Oh, yeah, it is. I really like oh, what you me way back. Options, brightness. There we go. And now it's marginally easier. You're into art, right? Ah. You could audit an art class. So they're not all in the same place? I don't think that's where I got the last one. Oh, good. A dead end. Fantastic. Oh, good. You're over there. Oh, wow. You are so much worse when the brightness is turned off. It's the sudden movements for me that get with this enemy. With the... I don't know. What are we calling this enemy again? Cherry, cherry Blossom? Is there one around here somewhere? Oh. Oh, yeah. No, there wasn't one there. No, Akris. That is not what we're calling the enemy. Bad Akris. Down. Is this where I started? No. Oh. Right, so we already got that one. Nothing here. We already got that one, which is fine. Let's go through this door. Oh, no, let's not go through that door. Oh, the door shut on me. The door pushed me back into it. That's what happened there. The door pushed me back into the enemy. i turn that down a bit because I have a feeling that background noise is quite incessant. <laughs> All right. Oh, no, no comment this time. Interesting. We've died so many times. She's run out of dialogue. Okay, there was nothing in there, was there now? Oh, that was the first stutter of the game. Me 
way back. Yep. Awesome. Thanks. You're very welcome. I gotta go. I got more, slightly more pressing matters. Oh, I can hear it. Skip, skip, skip the dialogue. Skip the fucking dialogue. I think the phone reacts when I'm near one. Right, so there should be one in here somewhere. Yes. Excellent. What's that? Oh, you like what you see? Eepies, eepies. I gotta go. Uh, right, so there's one nearby. Ish. Possibly. Down here. Maybe. Yes. Yes. I can hear it. I can hear it. We can hear it. What are you hiding inside? Right, excellent. Now where the hell do I go? First off. Where's I'm sorry. Where's Stampy Long Branch? Come on, Stampy. There you go. Alright, let's get out of here first so the phone doesn't keep reacting to them. Good, good. Now lead me, mobile device. GPS coordinates for the fucking exit. <gasps> That's not how physics works, game. Wait, is there one in here? Is this where I need to be? Or is there just another picture in here? I don't know, where are you? Oh, no, you're there. I will see you later. I'm going to go back the way I came. Back the way I wanted to go, which I can't remember the direction anymore. Bugger. Oh, no. And this is... Oh, it's this door. It's the door I went... It's the it's the door. Oh, there's one left. No. Get looped. See you later. <laughs> it's in here. It's in here. It's in here. Whew. <laughs> right, I gotta go in here, maybe. There, it's there, it's right there. You're way too hard on oh, thank God! Right, go, 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 go. Where are you? You psychopathic! Oh, what? Don't start locking doors on me. Oh, wow. I, I, I don't know if they've always been there. Is Cardo getting longer? No. Yeah? No. Maybe? Oh, okay. You just completely ignore me now, are you? Is that how, you, that how we're doing it? You've had what you need from me. A good scare. There we go. Safe. First try as well. That was really good. Am I gonna be alone forever? <laughs> no. The cherry blossom person is gonna be with you forever. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Right. What are we looking at now? Are we looking at the sketchbook? No. Are we looking at the art? No. Are we looking at the bin again? No. Have I missed something like Turbo Obvious? Oh, there's a book here. Yes, I have. Maya's Diary. I've been really absorbed in my work lately. I decided to paint the girls who jumped off of the roof. Oh, no. Jumped off of the villa roof. I'd like to think they left this place for something better. I think I might finally be free of my despair because I've never felt this inspired. I'm going to put every last bit of myself into this piece. My roof piece is almost done. It might actually be my crowning achievement. 
But once this is done, then what? Do I have it in me to come up with something even better? How much longer can I enjoy the fame and praise I get now? Is there despair and disappointment waiting for me around the corner? The sadness that gripped me before has clawed its way back into my mind. I guess it was always there. Who knows how often it will show up? The thought makes my skin crawl. Maybe I should just end things while I'm still happy. Go out on a good note. I wish I could talk to someone about this. Oh no. At approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th, popular graffiti artist C.B. Maya Akko Heidenberg, uh, Hindenburg was found collapsed on the grounds of an apartment building in Ketter. In Ketterstadt. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. Collapsed. The death of the 18 year old comes as a shock to not only local community members, but also to all those who, who were familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of death may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of any warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out foul play and are proceeding with a full-scale investigation. Wait. She killed herself half a year ago? And that means I've been here this whole time? What'll it take for you to forgive me? Please, end this. Just let me die. <laughs> so what new ones have we got now? Is this... me? When did she draw this? I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. What are you hiding inside? Don't worry about what people think. Be proud. didn't notice me. So, she did notice her. Oh wait, was that- did I examine that? No. And I don't need to examine that anymore, I don't think. Oh, this is different. I was so happy when my mom liked the first picture I drew. Someone finally did love me. You actually noticed me. I never thought you would. Only. What should I do? Does this lead outside? Yeah, this is the stairway to the roof, isn't it? Anita, what's up? I'm sorry, Amelie. 
I'm such a piece of shit. I had no idea she'd do that. What are you talking about? Did something happen? I thought I was invisible. That I didn't matter. No matter what anyone had said. I didn't listen. Anita? But you and Maya, both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you, Amelie. You were always there for me. I'm... I'm going to go apologize to Maya now. Wait! Anita! Calm down. Just listen to me. I just... Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. But I don't really mind. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love, and for those who love me, I want to keep moving forward and never look back to 18-year-old me. That was really good. Maya has not been saved. Bad ending. Maya has not been saved. I don't think Maya could be saved. <laughs> that was very powerful and very weirdly emotional. Um, probably because they were just like, let's think of every traumatic thing and squash it into a, I'd say, a short video game. It was about, what, three hours? Yeah, about three hours long. So a, a short, it depends on your moving day it feels kind of scary leaving my hometown but i'll be fine i have my best friend with me i want to like that post loneliness creeping to my skin endless pain dropped in vain when i see Amazing music as well. Gotta say, 
Like, Silent Hill have a, a habit of putting absolutely quality songs. I'd be interested to know who did the music, because I don't know if it's the same band. They sound very similar to the band who did Silent Hill 3. Uh, yeah, Silent Hill 3. So, yeah, that was really good. Uh, good game, but the Maze Chase was tiresome. The Maze Chase was a bit tiresome. I think because... Every time you face that creature, let's call them Cherry Blossom. So my only critique there is every time you face that creature, you are encouraged to flee as far away as possible and loop the creature and flee and loop the creature and flee. There was no indication. The first bit, when I didn't know where I was going, that's on me, that's a skill issue. Um, but the, the bit where it was like, oh, you need to collect so many photos. I was running around for a while before I, I figured that out. Like maybe have something like that as not a tutorial but like before you leave the room pick up one and show on the phone like oh what a chain has come off the door and you're like oh the door where's the door and then you know have it have it sort of show you that because having to figure it out because the the thing you've taught me up until that point is that creature's coming after you you have to run away from it and you've put that chase mechanic in a maze with in it you basically made it pac-man right you've made it so i'm running around one maze with something chasing me and i have to collect lots of things whereas realistically what's happened before is it's been a drag race i get to point a before you get to point a and that's that's where the difference is but that's just me maybe you know that's that's what it felt like anyway but everything else really top-notch stuff i love the atmospherics of it i love the sound design it was very good um I guess the burning question is, did it feel like a Silent Hill game? Uh, no, is the honest answer to that. The knee-jerk answer is no. It felt like a good Japanese horror game, you know? I could have I could have heard their voiceover in Japanese and be perfectly happy with it and had subtitles. Um, and it felt like there was going to be more in regards to, oh, this is the, the witch's curse and this is the what what the the family curse was and this is what happened and all this sort of stuff it felt like there was going to be more a little bit around that and it did kind of feel not it was a sudden gear shift to it slowly introducing elements that were let's call them silent hilly uh like the the chain link fences like the um well, essentially, the chain fed the rot, the rust, everything like that. But then it trying to tell you, um, actually, the Silent Hill phenomena is... Da, 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 sorry. The phenomenon is something that happens to you psychologically. So maybe they're introducing that as this. This is actually what you saw in Silent Hill 1 was the Silent Hill phenomenon for James Sunderland. What you saw in Silent Hill 2 was, uh, not James Sunderland, uh, Harry Mason. What you saw in Silent Hill 2 was the Silent Hill phenomena for James Sunderland. What you saw here is the Silent Hill phenomena for this person. So for Anita. Oh, that's really nice. Good art as well. I don't lie. Very good, very good graffiti art. And yes, obviously, if you feel triggered by any of this, you can go and find a helpline at findahelpline.org or use the Crisis Lifeline information that's on there. I like that that's changed. Choose a chapter to start from. What, how many chapters were there? Oh, just three. <laughs> options now there's not gonna be anything different is there so yeah so for the say for the purposes of youtube this has been an absolute wild ride for me i've enjoyed every second of this this gives me faith that the silent hill franchise isn't as dead as i thought it was um i don't know how it's going to impact or affect silent hill 2 remake i don't know i saw a new trailer of that we'll probably watch that on stream shortly but we'll probably uh, go through that and have a bit of a chat about it um but i I'm confident that the Silent Hill franchise, the Silent Hill name, can be used in future for good horror content and good horror games. I say content like it's, oh, it's good horror videos. Good horror, you know, 
uh, games, media, movies, that sort of thing. It feels like it's it's it might have a bit of a resurgence. I could be wrong, but it feels like it might have a bit of a resurgence, especially if they start sprinkling some of that sort of uh, occult mysticism into the mix. Because as soon as you explain something horror wise, it loses power, right? You, if you explain something as it's a it's an axe wielding maniac, you're not no longer fearful of the thing that you don't understand. You're fearful of the axe wielding maniac. So. The fact that I had no idea what that creature was, that gave it a bit of weight and gravitas and it gave it a presence. So yeah, so anyway, I'm babbling on. I'm going to save that for another time. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this YouTube video. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it half as much as I've enjoyed recording it on stream. If you want to join everybody here live in chat, you can join us every Tuesday and Thursday on twitch.tv forward slash wholesome horror gaming. But for now, stay safe, stay spooky, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much. <laughs>